the bloggers and designers that are part of this challenge are so varied. Um, we have somebody doing lighting, we have somebody making an outdoor planter out of recycled material, we had somebody making a leather gown, wallpaper. For the HP Design Challenge, we created a fashionable floral wallpaper design that was inspired by the work of Then Voodoo uh, from Project Runway. We both love wallpaper a lot. She's a wallpaper designer and I've actually used her wallpaper on my TV show. It's like this amazing pink and gold fabric or pattern, so we both knew that we loved wallpaper. I chose to be matched up with Mila from Project Runway. She was a contestant on season seven and also the All-Stars. I thought it would be really fun to do something a little bit different on my site because we typically feature a lot of art and furniture and I thought fashion would be a really fun direction to go in. I was thrilled by the reader's selection of leather and Bauhaus because not only do I love the Bauhaus period, but I love working with leather as well. So I was pretty excited about that. We created a collar. Uh, it's a, called the Art Deco Collar and it's a reversible piece made of silk, uh, white lambskin and cast bronze pieces. For the HP designer matchup, I chose a design studio in Seattle called Gray Pants. They make lighting and furniture from reclaimed and recycled materials. Uh, we were challenging ourselves to create an object from something that was discarded, so we were trying to take old bottles and basically turn those into light bulbs. Uh, we've always been a very hands-on design studio from day one. Um, we've always tried to bridge the gap, I think, between kind of handcrafted designs and also technology. So we, we came up with five options, right? Mm -hmm. We were very excited about the opportunity, came up with five options right away. There was a birdhouse, there was a, a pavilion. pavilion, there was the glow planter that won. And and there was a terrarium. Yes, and a torch, a night torch. And we really, really wanted the birdhouse to win, and we were surprised that they selected the glow planter. Right. But right. I think the material also surprised us, right? Right. So the, the back, before we designed the five options, they gave us, uh, they gave the readers a vote on what materials we were going to use. And so it funneled down to, we had to make something for outdoors out of reclaimed, upcycled, or repurposed materials. And we have to make it fabulous. <laughs> and that was the challenge. Everything had to happen really fast from beginning to end. And they had to create the design and then turn around and actually make it within about a week. So. That was probably the most challenging part. Yeah, we tend to think with our fingers a lot and sketching and drawing, and it's nice when technology and your hands can meet in that way and you can create and design. The color matching system was really great too in terms of having the vibrance of the colors, and that helps because Emily and I were going back, back and forth with Pantone shades, and yeah. that can be hard when you're looking on a computer screen, you're not sure if that shade's gonna match, but the brilliance of the HP actually did help us. The actual colors that we came up with are the exact match to what you see in the final wallpaper design. And I think that the computer and the technology helped that to happen. It's so nice to be around other creative people that, that you don't always get exposed to. I would have never met half these people if, if I hadn't been a part of this project.